Welcome back, everybody, back to another BitCube's news episode. Well, a little bit differently this time, because I'm going to showcase some things that have changed on the server lately and also announce a big update that's coming up, where I do need everyone's attention before it happens. Well, as you can see, I'm in the survival spawn, well, at least the lobby. And as you can see here, we have a new board with a green line going to survival because some people had problems with finding the survival gate because they saw a lot of gates. The event hall is uh, not being used at the moment, but lately uh, there were some changes. This one is a uh, banner currently that's uh, showing everything offline. It's fake. It's not working at the moment. So one thing to note, and this is the big change that we are going to happen. The economy update is coming up and which will change the way we work with money. Currently we have a money vault um, where you can uh, whoop, teleport to and then you have your vaults over here. Let me try to find my own. There it is. I don't have a button. Thank you. As you can see here, this is the old economy system working with skulls and flowers. The new economy system is going to replace those. So, to be short, let's get on. Uh, we had in, in the latest weeks, um, we have the gold bags. If you kill a mob, they will drop gold bags. And um, the owner of that plugin also has another plugin which supports item based gold bag currency. Which means you have to use that gold to pay for stuff. But you can, beside that, use it for payments and more. This is uh, a little bit better because it doesn't break every update, beside the fact that many plugins we currently run are having issues with the current economy system we use, Gringrots. Um, we are using Gringrots for a while now and there are no updates. Uh, there was an update a long time ago and uh, that update caused a uh, re-enabling on my server. So I installed it again because I really liked it. It works, but not as it's supposed to. Sounds strange, right? Anyways, um, if you take a look at the uh, money, if you do slash money, you can see that that works fine. Now, well, that's my balance, but um, it works fine. Besides, as you can see, the inventory balance and the vault balance. If you take a look, it has a, uh, underneath the wall currency, you see a 0 0.01 with the inventory balance, which is incorrect because I do not have anything in my inventory so that's something that's broken as well beside the fact that if somebody sells something for like 10 cents and somebody else has that glitch but instead of one cent it says 12 cents for example they can buy endless stuff which is not the way we are working normally then it will glitch out and do not yeah well it creates money in the server that doesn't need to be created anyways i think it's way better to change that system to a more basic and stable system. Uh, the things that are gonna change is for example the banking. Currently we have over here then the teleportation to the money vault. When the update is there it doesn't require me to be online anymore when you need a bank because you store your own money at home. If you want to store money on a bank itself, you can go to one general bank, which will be in this global bank as well. Simply next time you can click on this one and instead of teleporting to this giant building, you will be teleported to a room beside here. Because here we have the item banker and the, uh, the ATMs. And there will be a new room over here, which has a special guy that, yeah, well, does the uh, the money banking 
of course there is a limit that's going to the money banking because we do not want people spamming and cheating in money and such so um, we set a default value I have not tested his plugin yet which means I do not know every feature out of my head but what I do know is it, it, it will be uh, solving a lot of trouble up to the next thing I wanted to show you guys um, the latest video on my channel because that latest video showcased uh, some pipes do not look at the error message in my chat I'm working on it uh, the new pipes on the server which work together with the resource pack so I'm going to it right now um, over here we have the pipes as you can see it's vanilla rendering at the moment so let me go up thank you these are the pipes and they are not looking too great because I did not enable the resource pack for myself. Let me turn that around. As you can see here, the resource pack isn't loading and this problem will be solved today. It was working before, it now isn't working. So I'm taking a look at the uh, resource pack system. Because when the economy update launches, it also launches a new version of Spidget uh, by, by then. Because uh, the economy update is not uh, starting up soon. So let me turn that back. Vanilla rendering. Looks a bit better, I think. Uh, well, anyways. The, uh, the resource pack thing is broken at the moment. But uh, beside that, the tab list also doesn't update live anymore. It updates when you disconnect or connect. So if I do tap in, and now I can see that I'm seven hours and three minutes online. If I reconnect to the server, it updates with the time that I have literally played at the moment. The elite mobs are back. Fellow warning, the mobs will be increasingly angrier at you if you kill a lot of them if you live with other people make sure that you're armored up and that you know what you're doing i think that's uh, everything for now i hope to see you soon and i uh i will be waiting for responses so if you have anything to say about the update just found find me on the teamspeak server and I will happily talk to you about this change. Thank you very much. And I see you all next time.